Hey YouTube, Doug Beatty here, and I want to talk a little bit more about my axe head handle for my CRKT Woods Children Tomahawk. I've had this for a little bit less than a week now, and uh, I fashioned this cane for it pretty soon after I got it, maybe two days after I had it. I also made a shorter handle. But right now, let's talk about this one. This makes an excellent cane, and I wanted to see how it did as an axe, so I took it out of my wood lot, and I found a standing dead small maple tree that's been choked out. I just want to get a quick idea how it chops. Why don't we take a look? Hello YouTube. This has got to be the shoddiest camera stand ever. You're watching me on my... kind of embarrassing. This is my Kindle Fire 8 inch camera here. And what I've actually done is taken my trusty dusty CRKT Woods Chogan. Very experienced with this. I've had it all for about four days now. Seriously, I just got this the other day and I made a walking stick handle for it. I've taken a walk out in my woods. It got me here. Now we're going to eat this little sassafras leaf and chop down a dead tree. See how this thing chops. Bear with me. I do have a mangled right leg, so it's a little harder for me to get up. And uh, right now, you're going to get a great view of my bodacious booty while I take my CRKT Chogan axe head cane and cut down this small dead maple tree here. Looks like it got choked out. Justin, what's up? Alrighty, right back to it. Now this wood is dead, it's fairly well cured, and one thing I was very surprised about was once you get it measured up, very easy to hit with this contraption, this is a curved handle, gives a little more oomph to the top, and uh, I need that. I'm 57 years old, I have a mangled right leg, which causes me all kinds of problems when I'm trying to cut, especially if I'm trying to use swords and trick cuts. And right now, I need a hernia operation. Didn't mean to get too personal, but just want to let everybody know, I can't put a lot of force behind this. So what you're basically seeing is just the weight of this Chogan. And there she goes. Boom. So it walks, it talks, and it smacks. Well, thank you for watching that if you're still with me and bearing with all my technical insufficiencies. I have also made an axe handle, um, a, a cane length axe handle from my Cold Steer Frontier Hawk. Excuse me, I could talk when I sat down, believe me, I could. And this one's a little bit longer and a little bit lighter than the one for the Chogan. And if you did not know this about Cold Steel Tomahawks, the Viking hand axe fits their st standard Tomahawk handle. So you can put your smaller hawks on that longer Viking hand axe shaft. You put the Viking hand axe on smaller shafts. And next time we go out, we might see how it chops at the end of this sucker. So thank you for watching. And uh, I'll have a little bit more when I do a cutting test with my cold steel hawk. Take care. Thanks for watching.